a freaking fluffy store. Well, I question why I'm still doing this. <laughs> I need to adjust the timer so I make sure I don't completely go overboard on this. Uh, we're gonna keep on going. Here we go. Welcome back to loading. <laughs> The weather during the hottest period in the summer is usually ho usually hotter, even if it's early in the morning. When I'm about to have sweet dreams, I can still hear vaguely hear the dawn by the candles. The, since e either way, the cash register. Counter is extremely hard after sleeping tonight. My hips and back hurt, and my legs are numb. I'm questioning why. <laughs> I'm gonna move this to up here. This at uh, this hour, in, excuse me, in the morning. What's the next door neighbor quarreling about? Upon listening carefully, the voices aren't from the aunt next door, but from two girls. Girls? Why are they appear in my Why would they appear in my store? Customers? Alright, the girls showed up by accident. After I messed around yesterday, Evening, and these three girls caused me to sleep on the counter. Oh god, he's gonna take it out of her, her paycheck. You know you're gonna get in some trouble, right? <laughs> okay. <laughs> Sherry, you're gonna get in some trouble. He's gonna take it out. He's gonna dox your pay, anyways. Uh, yeah. <laughs> All I have to do, all this dude has to do is just sneak over and just ask what to do. Yet. The you know that you two are gonna get in some serious trouble. <laughs> the rabbit at least has some reason. Fox over there, not really. And poof. It's really so ter uh, troublesome. I sigh and grumble softly. After thinking for a while, I can't take it anymore, and pretend to get up and stretch myself. Ah, ooh. You deserve head pats. <laughs> Good morning, Parin. You're up so early. Where is Cherry and Puff? I know something's off by now. 
I'll look for them myself. Get ready for work. It's the first day of our business. Let's do our best together. I stand up to bet my clothes and walk straight to the storage area. I know you're trying to protect them, but we need to get them in trouble. Hmm. I'm going to the storage area to take something there but first before going upstairs. <laughs> She's trying so hard. This girl would even try to stop me from going towards the storage area. Too naive. I have years of experience on skipping classes. You try your trick is just like a junior school student playing house. I make use of the cartons of goods and cereal myself control myself before stopping the door no shoving no shutting the door to the storage area quietly. Ah, it's Pop's voice! She's also here! On the first day of business, two out of three of my employees are eating in secret. Can my store survive? I'm gonna dox their pay! <laughs> I kept leaning, uh, lamenting on my heart and peek from behind the shelves. <laughs> Cherry is holding the bag of potato chips, and the two girls are sharing it by talking, taking turns to take one mouthful each. Can't exactly get mad. I don't know. <laughs> I hope this guy just makes fun of her sherry for this. <laughs> I'm gonna. I just hope he makes fun of the freaking fox for this. <laughs> Dear God, please do! What? What the hell happened? How did the she manage to lift up such heavy stacks? Of boxes with only one hand. Intrigued. <laughs> one hand is holding up the stack of box, the stack, and the other hand is rummaging through the box. Uh, uh, you two are gonna get so much of your paycheck doxxed for that. It looks like they would eat it, eat up everything in the storage area if I don't stop them. What are you doing here? <laughs> I like our main character's face, like, what the hell? <laughs> 
Hmm. From where did you get these things in your hand? <laughs> at least, <laughs> at least being honest about shit. Okay, she's. She might be the dumb one. <laughs> Sherry and Pong gave different answers simultaneously. <laughs> and then they look at each other suspiciously, speechless. I wonder why. No, you said everything perfectly, Puff. I nearly burst into laughter. <laughs> Besides the one from the box, what about the other one? What about the one in your hand? I want to take it from you just to tell where you got it. Sherry moves her eyeballs as if she's coming up with another cooked idea. You're lucky he doesn't fire you right now. <laughs> Cause that's your boss. <laughs> You're sure you you are hungry and not greedy? Okay, to be honest, you cheeky fox. <laughs> you fucking cheeky fox. God dang it. <laughs> I become speechless. It's true that they are the same. Okay, where's the bag? You couldn't even give like a really poorly photoshopped bag. I criticize it, but I'd at least give you credit for at least trying. I wouldn't care if it's like poorly photoshopped. As long as I can. Uh, for Pete's sake, I'll criticize frickin' anything. <laughs> Unless it really leaves me speechless. I know, I know. But I'm worried that if you go and go on like this, the salary you'll get at the end of the month can't even pay for all the things you ate in secret to satisfy your food cravings. <laughs> The salaries are like, um, depending on how much you eat. <laughs> I'm not, I don't want you two to eat all the food. What black hearted boss are you talking about? <laughs> Might be an ass, but I have, to, I have to get a paycheck for not only myself, but you too. <laughs> And the rabbit. No matter where you work, your salary will depend on your work performance, and it's bad to take away stuff in a shop without getting permission first. I explain it to them patiently, as if I'm teaching kids. Yeah. In in future, just tell me if you're if you want to take something. I will make things hard on you if you if it's responsible. Yeah, but I'll criticize you. Can I give these items and turn them open? Tear, turn them open back to me. I want to see this guy's answer. Just take them. 
Just remember, they're coming out your pay. And in an instant, she's happy again. Damn fox! <laughs> this is the second fox that's on my channel so far. YouTube channel. God damn it. Actually, no. Second fox. Either way. You freaking look at it. It's still the second fox. <laughs> I'm gonna turn off my timer because I know it's beeped far too many times. Uh, such a smile that is gentle and charming as the wind in the spring. It'd really make anyone feel dizzy. Hmm. I wonder why. Either way, I'll see you guys next episode. I hope these two stop stealing food. And I hope all of you have a great and wonderful day too. I'll see you guys next time.